killing a woman who died six hours ago. <laughs> That's what we need priority homicide to find out before we have to release him. Here's how it'll work. Janet Powell, the deputy DA who prosecuted Krolik, will call his defense counsel, who in turn immediately petition the court for a writ of habeas corpus. And the DA won't oppose that motion? Well, they'll do what they can, but the conviction was based on tying Krolik to Lisa Barnes, not just through his M.O., but also through her physical and personal characteristics. Everybody's sure he killed somebody. Yeah, but he went to great lengths to make sure we couldn't ID the Vic. Cut off her hands and feet, set her on fire twice, pushed her off a cliff in a car. Tell me, thorough.